Hi everyone. Let's talk about the Victron OS new update, or let's check on the newest version and latest version, which hopefully might be a new version than the 2.73. Let's figure that out. Here we're back again on our Raspberry Pi and it's 10.48, quite late in the morning. It doesn't matter, California time of course. So I wanna check if we have maybe an update or something like that ready to be installed on our Raspberry Pi. So that's what we're going to do. I'll go on settings again. I'm, I'm, again, I'm connecting my computer via remote uh, on the remote console to my Raspberry Pi. Then I click on settings with my mouse. Then I can see there's firmware, click on firmware. And I can see I'm running the firmware version 2.73. And that's the current firmware version. So let's see, online updates, check only. You can see that it's uh, pressed to update to version 2.85. So let's try to figure out what changes or release notes are available. Okay, when clicking on this professional, which I have no idea what it is about, click on firmware, which is very interesting. I've never seen this. Disclaimer, I agree, of course I agree. I also agree. I'll go to Venus OS and then show me 2.85. Yeah, that's what it is. Okay, from a change log. Oh, cool. That was a turn. I'm pretty sure they changed something. Okay, what do we have? Change log. Yeah. That's what we're looking for. 2.85 changes. Here we have all the changes. I'll copy them also in the description below so you can find it so I don't have to go through everything in detail. But I think it's very important for everyone else what's in there. All right, and then we can also see 2.84 down here. Okay. There's a big focus, it looks like, for the Servo GX components. What's pretty much similar to our Venus OS image we're using here. So we have to test if everything works afterwards really in terms of all the USB connections and uh, sensors we've connected. All right, I'll copy it in the description below so you all have access to this one since I just had to sign up for the professional uh, website here. All right, I'll go ahead, check only, I'll press update. And I'm installing it now. There's no turning back. Firmware installed, rebooting. Let's see how quickly it reboots. Oh, it's back up online. I'll go on settings. It took about an hour, uh, one to two minutes probably. Firmware, and now we see there is the 2.85. Press check. No new version available. We're done with the update. All right, that's gonna be all. I just want to make a quick video, but uh, it appeared to be a little longer, so I have to figure out why everything is available on this professional website now. I'm pretty sure I missed something out the last weeks or whatever, so I have to look into that. Um, it's something I was able to sign up. I guess it's also something you can sign up in case you just want to see the, re see the release notes. And uh, as you can see here, the Venus OX uh, and other GX products, you can download an image, upgrade image, etc. So that's quite interesting how to update. Um, so yeah, I'm, I'm taking it with the Craft Saw right now because they changed it and I really don't, don't want to mess it up. But uh, thanks for watching again. Hope to see you next time. Tschüss!